Hey guys, my name is Jesse with Blue Alpha. I'm here today to talk a little bit about the tourniquet holder that we made um, and a little bit about how we've made it. So when we first looked into making a tourniquet holder, we thought, hey, what kind of tourniquets we want to hold? And we decided a cat tourniquet is what we wanted to hold. And a Sharpie made sense because when you are applying a tourniquet, you need to write down what, you, uh, what time you put it on. Uh, but also a Sharpie is just nice to have when your buddy falls asleep and you want to give him a mustache. So that being said, uh, when we designed this, uh, Tegris was just kind of a, a new thing and uh, it was a new thing for us as well. We had uh, seen it at uh, a few trade shows that I've been to and uh, basically what Tegris is, is it's a polypropylene uh, woven material that uh, is laminated and uh, they, they laminate it in six ply, eight ply, and 12 ply. And it's also, you can sew it, which is kind of neat. Uh, so we laser cut it and we can sew it. Um, when we designed this, I had come up with a, a, a few different iterations of this design where um, some of them were too weak and would pull apart too easy. Um, and then we kind of arrived at where we're at now after just lots of testing. So the, the front part of it with the elastic is, uh, is sewn to the Tegris. And we actually put bar tacks in the four corners on this elastic just to prevent it from coming out. And you'll see that, that those bar tacks actually intersect with the, the squadron on the back as well, just to make sure that it holds all of it together, kind of like a puzzle piece. So on the back where the molly panel is, uh, the, um, we, uh, we engraved uh, our logo into it, into the strap, and then on the molly part, uh, there is a piece of Tegris that's sewn into there that allows you to, it helps in, in weaving the molly through the slots. And uh, these slots are, are done at half inch intervals to allow you ultimate adjustability up and down um, vertically. And then when this, um, when this tourniquet holder comes to you, uh, there's, there's two pieces of one wrap that come with it that allow you to just go right through these holes and attach it straight to your belt or to anything else. I think Kurt has it attached to his, uh, his handle and his car, uh, lots of different applications for this. Uh, so you, again, you can attach it vertically and horizontally. That was kind of the main motivation for us making this was how can we find ways to attach it both vertically and horizontally um, without adding too much bulk or too much cost. One other way that we wanted to attach it was to allow for the guys that are using chest rigs or plate carriers uh, to be able to put it behind their placard or sandwich it between their placard. This is the dangler, this is the option to do that with. So you, you just attach this to the tourniquet holder itself and you put it on there and you got hook and loop on both on each side and that allows you to attach it to a plate carrier or chest rig. If you want one of these, go to our website. Uh, also, I'm, I look forward to hearing anything in the comment section. Like, subscribe, we'll see you in the next video.